This is David Rodecker. I'm here to tell you about uh, Google Pigeon Update, which is the most recent uh, major effect we've seen to the search engine result pages and uh, what it means for us. So uh, one of the biggest implications is that local search is now something that you need to get implicitly local search results from. In the past, we've seen that you've been able to provide explicitly local search queries like DUI Attorney Los Angeles. DUI Attorney Los Angeles here, though, is not providing any Maps Pack results. And even when I specify my location, and notice here that I have to do so by in Search Tools, and there's a drop down here. Right now it's using my current location. If I specify my location to Los Angeles, and I can just leave it at Los Angeles unless there's ambiguity of Los Angeles, California, notice that I'm still not getting local Maps Pack results. There may be other derivatives of search queries that would, but if you just reduced the query down to DUI attorney, at this point now I'm getting a Maps Pack results. I'm getting this Maps Pack over here, and um, it's a full Maps Pack listing. Similar things have been found to um, very general search terms, which do not include the city. So like patio furniture, this sometimes would deliver local search results. Uh, in the past, but now we're seeing a lot more tendency to show Maps Pack results when the city is not uh, specified, but when we have local businesses that are relevant to the search term. So it's imperative here to set the location to the business that we're looking to, to the city of the business in which we're evaluating search results. It's still possible to do things in which I can use my current location and look at the search results in Los Angeles. Notice that I'm doing this here and I'm located in Fountain Valley, but the search results may not be the same as if I didn't provide the search term and set my location to Los Angeles. So just to be, sh uh, just to be extra safe, always set your location to the, si to the city that we're looking for and go with the, uh, the ambiguous query of not specifying the city name because that's what Google is going to tend to prefer. The auto suggest features are going to pop pre populate only the term that allows for the quickest results for the users and the most specific results. So we have um, a real win here for local businesses that can take their content on Google Plus pages, prom promote that information, and have it appear for the basic search terms that they're looking for.